Um, and I finally, like, I know that I've filmed these pelicans a few times, but I have been struggling to get a clo decent close-up shot of them. So I decided that I would um, film them this time because they were in a different location to where they normally are. And, um, yeah, there's not really that much to say about these actual pelicans. Um, I, I just thought it would be nice to get a decent close-up shot of them. Um, uh, since I'm on here talking about these pelicans, I thought I might also mention that a new brood of pukekos has recently hatched. Um, there's four baby pukekos. Um, I did have actually seen them several times, but um, they're not too far away from this little island here. There's two islands in the middle of the um, of the river. But because they're so young, they haven't actually ventured onto dry land yet. So I haven't been able to do a close-up, like I get a decent close-up shot of the new baby pakekos, like the four little chicks that have just hatched. But when, as soon as they do venture onto dry land, I will definitely make a video of those particular birds. And I actually have been monitoring the adult, uh, the, um, the teenage pakekos, which are very, very close to um, being fully developed now. Um, I yeah, there's there's not really. I mean, I I have actually made a short clip of those, and I will post it soon. But there's not really um, that much difference in like their development at the moment. It's kind of slowed down, so they're basically in their final stages of development at the moment, and. Um, their beaks have changed colour, but they haven't got their full adult musculature. Um, like they just, they st you can still tell that they're juveniles, even though their beaks have changed colour. So their beaks still haven't completely developed, and they're like the the structure of their body is still a little bit immature looking. So there's still a bit of development to happen there, but um. I just thought I'd mention that since I kind of feel like I'm filming the same thing over and over with those birds, but they're very, very close to being adults and they do still recognize me. But this pelican's gorgeous up close and I just thought I'd film this because there needs to be a bit of variety on my channel. So, um, yeah, like this is sort of the busiest time of year for birds like pelicans and um, it's the best time to catch them probably. 